Ladies and gentlemen, I am pleased to announce the very first on a right hand successful flight of the November 901 Echo Echo to Perlin 2. Air friend, congratulations to you. Today was the first time we flew the airplane. Uh, today was the inaugural flight, and it was a test to make sure that the airplane was controllable and stable. And it's the first step on our way to 90,000 feet. The Perlin Project today did the first flight in a high-altitude research glider. It's a glider that's designed to fly to 90,000 feet. Uh, let me put that in a framework. The SR-71 can fly at 85,000 feet with an engine powerful enough to power the Queen Mary. And we're a glider, we have no engine at all, and we're going to go do atmospheric research into climate change and into weather that's impacted by giant mountain waves over the Andes Mountains. It's, it's exciting me beyond almost description because we've been working on this since 1993 was when our founder in our intervals and first had the vision of being able to sort of the edge of space in a motorless airplane. Long time with dozens and dozens of people working and volunteering. We're an all volunteer organization. And so uh, the amount of hours have been tens of thousands of hours to get to today. All of this started with just a spark of curiosity. Anar's curiosity of how we might reach the edge of space with no engine at all, beat the mighty SR-71 with a glider. And curiosity is what we want to pass on. Part of the mission of our project is to inspire young people to take whatever they think they are curious about and turn it into an adventure, turn it into an exploration. One more time. <laughs> <laughs>